Hey, it's 9 News Meteorologist Corey Reppenhagen with a quick look at your forecast. Now for Sunday, we're looking at a little bit of a warm up, but still below average. Uh, high of 52 uh, in Denver, a lot of 50s along the front range. Another nice day in the high country. Clear skies, some of our mountain towns uh, perhaps getting above the freezing mark for tomorrow. So uh, that'll be nice. Enjoy that before the next storm system rolls into the mountains. Take a look at the uh, computer forecast model here for tomorrow. A lot of clear skies and and a lot of sunshine out here on the Front Range and the Central Mountains. As we get to late Sunday night, you can kind of see this storm system just kind of approaching here. Uh, maybe some uh, early showers late on Sunday night. That's going to be our next mo noise maker, and it's going to make some uh, pretty good noise over the next five or six days, uh, especially in the high country. We already have winter weather advisories in place. Now, these start on Monday at noon, so that's the, kind of the first round, just advisories. But the uh, National Weather Service has also issued a winter storm watch that is going from Tuesday all the way through Thursday for almost the entire western slope here. So when the National Weather Service issues uh, a watch that far in advance, they're pretty high confidence that's going to have some major impact to the Colorado mountains. Now take a look at this jet stream pattern real quick, and this will kind of explain what's going on. Uh, we just have this kind of straight, even line right across the western United States. Great pattern for snow in the high country uh, on the western slope here and obviously California, Nevada, uh, Utah. But on the front range, you get all down sloping winds and mostly dry and windy conditions. So this pattern has kind of been in place for about two months and it's going to continue for another week here. You do see this low pressure system uh, approaching us a little bit of a lift uh, in the jet stream here on Tuesday that'll warm us up. But look at the jet stream straight over our head. That's going to be so warm and windy on the front range on uh, Tuesday. And then this uh, the, the actual cyclone of the winter storm system will slowly make its way towards us. And I'll tell you, you, you might be not able to tell, but this is a pretty weak bend in the jet stream. So it will impact us on Wednesday and Thursday but it does not look too impressive. Um, uh, we're looking at maybe here's the Wednesday and Thursday forecast in the seven day planner, not looking too impressive. Maybe some uh, light mixed snow and rain showers on, on uh, Thursday morning, some passing showers on Wednesday. But uh, on Monday, keep an eye on a, just a little brief system. We might hit uh, up in the upper 50s in the Denver metro area, but just a little at late evening uh, night system passing through maybe a little few showers. And then we talked about Tuesday being kind of uh, windy but warm on the front range as that system starts to impact the high country. And it really looks pretty similar to many weeks what we've had over the last couple of weeks. Uh, but we are watching one last storm system coming next weekend. Enjoy your day.